Today, the planetarium at the United States Air Force Academy hosted its first public event since the pandemic ended routine access to the public back in 2020. As News 5's John McMichael reports, it was packed with excited space lovers, happy to see the return of one more unique piece of our area. Talk to me, what's today all about? Today is about reintroducing the public to this awesome visitor experience that we have. An awesome visitor experience being the planetarium, located on the grounds of the United States Air Force Academy. We're really lucky to have this amazing facility. It's the first public event the space has held since things shut down in 2020, and it's decked with tech. It's a high tech, 360 degree digital. 13 computers all working together with six projectors to put together these amazing images of space. Far from being a quiet reopening to the public, troves of excited would-be planetarium goers flooded to the opportunity. I want to know when people are exiting here, what do you hope they are taking away besides, oh, that was cool. Just the immenseness of it and how fascinating it is that all that is out there. You feel like you're actually like in a spaceship and you like feel like that you're actually there. This miniature Final Frontier can seat more than 100 folks at a time, all with eyes trained on the projected sky. And we have a fantastic new astronomer uh, who joined our team uh, to start providing these shows to the public free of charge. Instead of looking at space from the surface of the Earth, we can look at the surface of the Earth from space. And it was just really cool to see, you know, the Earth, and then the, what's around the Earth, all the planets, the universe, it was just very cool. So, in short, it's educational, it's cool, and it's free. That's right. Those are three really big keys there. Educational, cool, and free. It's very exciting. Like, you feeling like you're on top of the world and then seeing what the size of things could really be. With all that said, there's only one last question. Is it something y'all want to do again? Yes, Most definitely, definitely yes. yes. Absolutely. This is a place we wanted to come. We're just really excited to be here. In Colorado Springs, John McMichael, News 5. And for more information on when you can go and grab a chair at the planetarium and explore the stars, head on over to KOAA.com. We've got some useful links to helpful information. Alan?